question. What conclusion did the great biologist Stephen Jay Gould draw from a lifetime study of fish? Oh. Yeah. They haven't got any legs. <laughs> <laughs> Is that his lifetime study? Yeah. Well, no. <laughs> it wasn't his lifetime <laughs> study of a fish. Yeah. He was, <laughs> after a while, they smell. Yeah. <laughs> He's, He's a bit thick, thick and he just stared at me and they haven't got any legs. <laughs> starfish, um, starfish don't have brains. It's the kind of Louis Walsh of the aquatic world. <laughs> <laughs> they really don't have brains, they're starfish. And oh. they're not really fish, aren't they, starfish, to be honest? Well, there were fishes in there, which kind of uh, uh, qualifies them, I think. Uh, well, is a starfish a fish? Is a jellyfish a fish? Well, yeah, cattle but... fish of fish? Yes, yeah, so but, but, but the starfish is a monster. <laughs> There's a division, isn't there, in the world, whether it should be down to sort of uh, experts in biology, whether things are fish or, or whether it should be down to menus. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, I think, for example, a crayfish comes under fish in a menu. He well, looks uh, like he's reading the sell by date on that. He does. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, was very, was was that very that great. He's dead him? now. He's very, uh, very great. He won a Nobel Prize. He was a paleontologist and an extraordinary biologist. And uh, he came to a conclusion which is they can feel no love. No, that they. <laughs> <laughs> that there is no such thing as a fish. A fish has no biological meaning. There is just... <laughs> well, that's so... I'm absolutely right. Go menu. with menus. On a menu, yeah. it does. <laughs> but in a menu, a fish is not the same as shellfish or seafood, is it? It often comes in the same bit and separate from well, pudding. Things that live in the sea. <laughs> <laughs> How, How can something... Pudding are different. Yeah. How can something not be something? Something can't be not be not something, can it? <laughs> but if you've created a something, then something has to be that something, otherwise you haven't created a something. So it has to be a fish. If there is the idea oh, of a fish in the first place. I swear there's a philosophy yeah. Yeah. somewhere. Slow down, slow down. Slow down. There's, there's some sort of ontological <laughs> argument going there. And of course, to us, that we, we use the word fish. fish. But biologically speaking, a salmon is more related to, say, a camel than it is to a hagfish. Like, there are lots yeah. of things that fly, right. like a bumblebee flies, a vulture flies, and there are flying lizards. They're, they're not all birds. No. But so, we call things so... that swim in the sea fish, and actually, Biologically, evolutionarily, they have absolutely nothing to do with each other at all. So, after a lifetime study of fish, biologist uh, Stephen Jay Gould concluded that there's no such thing as a fish.